I can't see! Ah, there's a big purple thing in my eye! Ah. Anyway, what's up guys? Mike here with another video review. Crimson Dynamo was the one I couldn't remember the other day. This guy right here. Crimson Dynamo with this big old purple thing on his head. It's supposed to be a laser blast. Or laser shooting thing, but it's failing miserably. What do I know about this guy? Absolutely nothing. I got him because he looked cool. I, but I shall read you his bio on the back of his box. Shall we read it together? I bet I'm going to screw up, screw this up really bad. Okay. Created by Russian scientist Anton Vanko, or Vanko, to perform miracles of electronic control. The Crimson Dynamo was every bit as powerful as Iron Man. Manipulated by his Soviet masters, Vank, I don't know, Vanko, Vanko, whatever it is. Very nearly defeated the American hero before he realized his mistake and committed himself to a cause of freedom. Oh, so he's a good guy, I guess. Or oh, oh. well, he was a bad guy, became a good guy. Oh, very interesting. I don't know, like that. Nice. Very, very nice. So, yeah, take a look at him. Uh, very cool. Very, very cool. Um... I already showed you his gimmick feature, I guess. It's this um, headband thing that goes on there. That would suck if he headbutted you. That would hurt like hell. Um, his articulation. Like, let's go into the detail first. Let's, let's look at his face here. As you can see, a little face. Yeah, like a little face. Yeah, yeah. Uh, the chest right there, yeah, like the little chest, yep, yeah. the little chest, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Uh, yeah, <laughs> I guess that's, he's red. There's nothing else to say. He's a red guy with orange eyes. Kind of looks like the Fallen. Not really, though. So, anyway, he's very muscular, dude. Yeah, that's very muscular. Anyway, articulation. He's kind of a loose figure, so kind of... Disappointing. His head can go all the way around. Kind of like try, trying to pull his helmet off. It looked like it was about to fall off, but I guess it won't. Um, his arms can go all the way around. Can go out. Can turn at the elbow. Can turn at the wrist. Um, has this upper body articulation right here, so he can swoo the ladies with this thrust action. Like, yeah, what's up, baby? How you doing? Um, his legs at the knee can bend, and his Feet can turn around and all that fun stuff. And just like the other figures, he has this ball joint crappy action that that just annoys me. If you want to put his leg forward, you gotta do all this stuff, but it's not working. Like it's stuck or some. I don't know. I'm not gonna try to force it. I'm, gonna, I'm afraid I'm gonna break it. But his joints are a little loose, and they, he doesn't stand a whole lot good. <laughs> a whole lot good. Done. Um, so, oh well, right, who cares? Pretty cool figures, though. I like him. He's definitely neat. Definitely a good new addition to the Iron Man franchise. Well done, Hasbro. That's who makes these, right? Okay, Hasbro makes these. Okay, good. Glad I'm not just, like, throwing out names and getting it wrong. <laughs> that would suck so bad. Anyway. Dynamite Crimson Doe. Crimson Dynamo. Dynamo. Crimson Dynamo. Okay, I think I've been saying it wrong the whole time. Crimson Dynamo. That's who it is. Alright. Okay. You guys have a good day. And if you're at the store, make sure to pick up some Iron Man figures. Because I'm going to get more because I'm very impressed with these figures. I'm very happy with these figures. I'm going to get more. And you can't stop me. Okay? 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 Goodbye.